Hello guys, welcome back. I'm Julian. I'm here to do my reaction video for season one, episode three of Hawkeye. This time the title of the episode is Echoes. And this is this week's episode of Hawkeye. I actually just got caught up with the previous two episodes and they were great. I really liked it. Um, but hopefully it kind of gets, you know, it, it picks it picks up a, a, a faster pace. I want that for some reason. Um, I just want the insanity that it is the MCU, you know. Um, and all of the other shows have had a big bad, you know, for for their seasons um, in whatever form they were, but they had. Uh, I'm not so sure who the big bad is. I feel like it's maybe it's a, a lot of them, but I, I have no idea. Anyways, I'm ready. I'm excited. I'm happy to watch a new episode. Uh, I am happy that I decided to do this, uh, to watch this show uh, because of Haley. Um, because I'm enjoying, I'm enjoying her character and I'm enjoying the entire story. So yeah, that's a plus because I do not like Jeremy Renner that much, but, uh, he's actually making me like feel things for Clint and like, I am not as upset at him as I used to be. So I'm okay with it. I'm kind of okay with him now. Anyways, with Clint, not with the actor. Anyways. But yeah, we're here. We're ready to watch a new episode of of um, of Hawkeye. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. Subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell. And you can go right now, right this second, to Patreon and watch the uncut reaction for this episode. And if this video is posted with the blurred out screen, uh, that means that YouTube hates me. And if you want to watch the normal version, this same version that you're watching on YouTube, but without the blur, you can do that on my Patreon link on the description down below. That one, that version is for free. So go and check it out. Um, and for now, I think that's about it. I hope you guys enjoy. And without further ado, let's just begin with season one, episode three of Hawkeye. Here we go. <laughs> Kate Bishop is going coastal. Who are you talking about? Her. <laughs> Who is we she? We have them. Get the fuck away. Okay, we're going back. Oh, she can't. Oh, she can't... She can't hear? Um, no. Maybe they are. But dragons they are. live in a different world. That's true, they do. No. I'm sorry. Oh. But in the end, it'll be better. Oh, will it be better for her? Who's that? <laughs> Maya, you're up. Who's that? Fight! Okay, Maya. Ooh! Oh, kick ass, yes. <laughs> That's just so badass. And she was there. Fat man, auto repair. Oh, the Ronin. Clint. He was fighting the, the tracksuit guys. I guess he was a bad man. Oh, that is so sad. 
I mean, was he evil? Shit. No wonder she wants him here. Seems like you're mad at me. <laughs> okay, it doesn't look like that right now, but you'd be lost without me, you realize that? Tell her she hurt your feelings, but apologize for pretending that that was a gift for her. Okay, wait, it's super. I need a pen. Just, okay, okay. <laughs> These guys are See, a joke. Maybe I rip out your throat, hmm? Or maybe she will. Oh, guys. Who is she? Uh, no, we don't know. Ah, bad. He is able to. He, he does speak with sign. Sign. More cookie, please. Thank you. Oh, okay. So a little, few words. And just because she's not the Ronin, doesn't mean that Ronin's not back. That's just a rumor. How do you know? Because he's dead. Mm. So who got him then? Natasha? Black Widow. So Ronan is dead, and the person who killed him is dead. That's convenient. How do you know this? Because I was there. You're lying. Well, in a way, she killed him. Okay, clearly this isn't working. It's not, it's not her! It's Mom, not him! No. Oh my god, I put that suit on because I didn't want anybody to know that I was at the auction. Okay. I didn't know what it was when I put it on, I swear. I swear. Oh, Jesus Christ. So, wait, is she your big bad? Oh man. Woo! She's lethal. Where is that? There we go. Amazing. Bazinga. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Oh, my God. Okay, they make a really good team. Oh yes, girl! That was badass! Thank you! I was doing fine. Yeah, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> okay, maybe more than four. Get in front of them! Get in front of them! Smile, you're moving. Trust a bro. <laughs> Hang on. Oh! Christ. Oh shit. You know, it took me a while to hear we were facing the other way. You were facing the other way. They were communicating. Yeah! <laughs> oh. That was a big one. That was definitely not Play Doh. <laughs> Your arrow? Oh, oh. Okay. That seems like a good one. Don't do that, Kate. On my mark. Ready? Okay, this is badass. Look at them. Okay. Oh, Pim. Oh. <laughs> that was badass. <laughs> Oh 
That's a useful arrow. Now I get the whole puzzle around thing. Pretty cool, huh? Oh, we gotta walk the dog. <laughs> You're not wrong. He's been cooped up all day. Got <laughs> your home on the dog. Call yourself one of the world's greatest archers. Thank you. Probably should walk the dog. Do you think? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Communication is key with this dude. up all day. <laughs> They're adorable together. It's, it's okay if you can home. You can be home for Christmas. Oh, it's um, kind of sad. I'm gonna be there, buddy. Hey, you know I'm gonna be there. Like I said, right? Oh shit. You are. Right. Oh shit. So it was his uncle's crew, now it's her crew, but someone else is the boss. Is that all done? Yeah. Can I get some more coffee, please? Yeah, sure. The entire time. <laughs> Thank you. You know, it's, uh, it comes with a price. What does? This life you want to live. To really help people, really try to help people, anyway. Comes with a lot of sacrifices. A lot of and them. Some things you'll lose. Yeah. Forever. Also, things you gain. Like trick arrows and cool costume. <laughs> Speaking of which, I've been thinking about your branding issue. <laughs> you need a more recognizable costume. <laughs> He's so dumb. Uh, you, what's that on his head? It's your head. Uh, <laughs> like a hawk. That's oh. an ancient. That's on your forehead. That's for Hawkeye. Wow. <laughs> okay. Um, you can't say who. Ronan is because it's someone close to you, isn't it? Very close to him, yeah. It's your job to keep their secret. Which is why we need more evidence. And why we're gonna sneak into my mom's penthouse. Wait, 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 what? We can get into her company's files. Bishop Security has a huge criminal database. There's gotta be info on the tracksuits and Jack in there. Yeah. Yeah, sure. I don't think about uh, of Jack, but maybe, yeah, we will find dirt. On your mom, for sure. Don't oh! Move. Shit. Okay, guys, so that was the end of season one, episode three of Hug. Oh! <laughs> That moved <laughs> of Hawkeye, uh, episode three. It was a really good episode, a lot of action, which I was craving. Um, they make a really good uh team, you know, um, as long as <laughs> Kate figures out what all the arrows do, but um, it was pretty funny and it was pretty, you know, solid and kind of like, like seeing this as a mentor. You know, kind of thing. It, it was kind of, it was, it was really fun. It was really, you know, um, it was pretty badass. It was pretty badass, because especially because you know, on this opportunity, we do realize how amazing of an of an archer she, uh, uh, Kate is. I mean, she says she's a good archer. We have seen her do really cool things, but on this one, she kind of just explodes, and it's just so badass to to see. Not so much maybe on the hand-to-hand -hand combat uh, kind of thing, but they, it was pretty badass. I really, really enjoyed it. I uh, really enjoyed their their dynamic. Um, I can't say, like, like 
daughter father type of dynamic because he does have a a, a daughter you know so yes well that is kind of like the 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 friendship we're kind of getting um will wouldn't uh his daughter will want to follow his footsteps eventually i'm not sure but I really enjoy uh, their dynamic on this episode. I enjoy when, when you know, he was being, uh, not by choice, but he was being vulnerable when he was he couldn't hear what his son was telling him. And she kind of helped him so he can uh, have the conversation through the phone, even though he couldn't hear. Um, and it's understandable, you know, he is not a super soldier. He's not a god. Of course, you know. The fact that he's been going around explosions and shit like that actually making he lost his hearing, which is, you know, it fits perfectly. Like, I have no doubt that, you know, one of those explosions kind of like did something bad to his ears. Um, and I kind of, I kind of, you know, I kind of liked it. And because, yeah, Hawkeye has always been, you know, more of like the, um, I'm gonna guess it's not anyone's first choice for a costume on Halloween, you know? Uh, but he is very inspiring. But, of course, there is this problem that he doesn't feel like one, you know? He doesn't feel like he should uh, be anyone's role model, uh, basically, because... Um, he feels guilty about what happened with Nat and he's telling Kate about it you know Kate is very young and with being young comes all this feeling invincible kind of thing you know but there are people that she cares about people that she might lose because of the path that she's deciding to follow through and he knows that and I think that even when they were young him and Nat and all of that you know they had that youth of like you know thinking that oh everything will work out we will get out but when it came to the really hard decisions they were able they, they, they made it and they paid a really high price for it you know and I think that he's trying to tell Kate that, that this path will be extremely painful to go through yes it is satisfying to help people and like you kind of have it in you to do that but uh, it doesn't come without the sacrifice, and I don't think Kate at the moment under at the moment understands that she's in the height of like I'm working with an Avenger, like I am doing these things, and like you know this is what I'm supposed to do, and she's very excited about that, without thinking about the repercussions that that might have in her life. You know, uh, she is suspicious of of Jack, but. So far, he has not done... Well, he is suspicious. And that's the reason why I think that he might be involved, but not to a very, like, to a big degree. I feel like there are other players, you know, here that might be even more dangerous than Jack himself, you know. Um, there is this little kid, this little girl, who turned out to be this very badass chick, you know. Who I, I one thing I do love the representation of having uh, someone who is deaf and also you know uh, has a prosthetic um, leg as well. I think that Marvel is really you know going into making their world as realistic as possible when you have super soldiers and gods and things like that. But if you can have all of that, the other side of the of reality should look more like the the world that we walk in, right? So, I mean, kudos to them for, for doing that. Um, so, yeah, um, pretty damn badass chick uh, who has it against Ronan without knowing that it is Clinton. Pretty, pretty sure that she will find out that it's Clint, the one who was behind the Ronin, you know, and who ultimately killed her uncle, who was the leader of this... The tracksuit dude who what who used to be like a small operation of like I don't know something illegal that they did, but became something bigger, you know. And now uh, Maya is her name. She's kind of the leader of this group, but at the same time, there's someone above her who might be that person who like grabbed her cheek when she was younger that we did not see his face 
I don't I have no idea who that might be. Um, if you wanna, if you guys wanna theorize, let me know in the comment section down below. I have no idea who it could be, but it could be our very big bad of the season. I wouldn't mind if Maya is our big bad, you know, and that's, you know, our main thread, um, because I think she's badass, you know, and she has a reason, and you know, it's 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 it makes sense. So I will be extremely happy if, she, if it's, it's her, but it feels like there is someone bigger behind her, you know? So, yeah. But I'm excited. I'm excited to see where this is going. Like I said, the action, like the entire action sequence during this episode was it was badass. And it was very much, you know, more more realistic because it's, it's not gods. It's not super soldiers. It's, it's more like, you know, bad guys fighting good guys. And it kind of was fun uh, to see all of that. And and it kind of made me feel for for Clint, which is something that it usually doesn't happen. I think I was like, I'm realizing that I was more mad about the fact that Nat didn't have a proper send off, you know, and her being one of the OG Avengers and not having a proper send off and not seeing that it affects anyone else the fact that she's gone but you know seeing that it affects Clint so much it kind of makes it seem like okay okay so at least someone is mourning her you know so I'm kind of like liking Clint a bit more now um because there was a lot of debate as well whether if it, it should have been Clint who went rogue and like started killing people who deserve to be here, or should it have been Nat? I mean, I will love Nat here. I will trade her for Clint at any moment. I'm, I'm not lying. But, you know, like the fact that they are acknowledging that people are affected by her sacrifice, I think it's it's something that I needed, you know? Um, but yeah, I love it this episode. I hope that you guys enjoyed it as well. Please don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe, comment, hit the notification bell, and you can go to Patreon right now and watch the full uncut extended version of this reaction. Or if you want to watch this same version without the blur, you can do that on Patreon as well for free. Link on the description or on the comment section. Go there and check it out. Um, and yeah, thank you to everyone who will be supporting my reactions for Hawkeye. Um, I hope you guys enjoy. And that's about it. Yeah, thank you so much guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time for more reaction videos for, well, next week for Hawkeye. But like in a day or two, another reaction for Dickinson, which also has Haley in it, which is, yay, amazing. Anyways, that's it. I'll see you guys next time for more reaction videos. Mwah. Bye, guys. <laughs>